Happy Friday, Pasco County, and welcome to this week's edition of the Pasco Sheriff's Weekly Report. I am Public Information Officer Melanie Snow. Right now, we are seeking the public's help in a home invasion that occurred on the 11th. Three black male suspects broke into a home on Silhouette Drive that was in Holiday. They were armed, stole multiple items from inside the home. They also duct taped a person inside the home. There were no injuries reported, but then they got away with quite a bit of stuff. We're still looking for any information regarding this case. We don't have images at this time, but if you have any information about this case, you're urged to call Crime Stoppers right away. And take a look at this video. This is from the Discovery Point Daycare at Crossings Boulevard in Odessa. If you can identify the person in this video, please call our tips line right away. These unknown suspects broke into two vehicles at the Discovery Point Daycare. They left in a white Nissan Rogue style SUV in an unknown direction. The occupants of the vehicle gained entry into one unsecured vehicle and forced entry into another, removing purses from both vehicles. The suspect vehicle was occupied by at least three black males. Again, call our tips line. And again, we remind you to please lock your car doors no matter where you are. And take a look at these images. We're attempting to identify this suspect at 3.40 a.m. on the 13th. This unknown white male was wearing a black hoodie, a beanie, black jeans, black shirt. He also had a black glove on his right hand and a camouflage glove on his left. He's six foot two, he's about 165 pounds with brown eyes and we're told bushy brown eyebrows. He entered this Circle K gas station on County Line Road. He was also carrying a firearm in his hand. While the unknown white male had the revolver in his right hand, he told the Circle K clerk to give him all the cash. He did leave with an unknown amount of cash. So if you have any information on who this person might be, again, go to our tips page on our website or call the number. Now it's that time of year where we are sending a lot of things through the mail. We're sending checks, we're sending cash, we're sending gift cards because it's the holidays. But take a look at this picture. Maybe you'll be a little more careful about what you leave in your mailbox. We are looking for this person who was captured on video going from mailbox to mailbox. This was in the Blossom Lake Drive area of Holiday. If you can identify this person or have any information, again, call our tips line. But just a warning about this type of thing. If you are going to be mailing something, make sure you are there at the time when you know the mail pickup is going to be, or perhaps maybe use a different type of mailbox, maybe a public mailbox instead as a safety precaution rather than the one in front of your home. And we've experienced a rash of auto burglaries, as I mentioned before, like with the Discovery Point case throughout the week. We've had various cases in different parts of the county. These three individuals are now in jail, all separate unrelated cases, but all auto burglary related. That's Ray Smith, Alan McKinnon, and Lasaya Chavis. They were all auto burglaries. Lasaya Chavis's case, he was armed when he committed his crime. And we want to remind you that our cold cases can be found on our website. If you go to the main page right there on your right side of the page, you're going to see the cold case link. Click that so you can stay up to date with some of the cold cases we continue to investigate. And if you have any information about any of them, you're urged to call Crime Stoppers. And that's it for us this week. Stay safe this weekend. A couple of things we'll leave you with. We are looking for some new employees here at the Pasco Sheriff's Office, if you go to our website, we have several job openings that you may be perfect for. Be sure to check those out. And also, we're dealing with people stealing things off of front porches. We're getting those packages in for the holidays. Detective Garcia has a video this week that we put together. Go to our YouTube channel. We are really trying to get the tips out so people know how to keep those packages from ending up in the wrong hands and uh, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Have a great weekend. Don't forget to lock those doors, 9 p.m. routine. I'll see you back here next week.